are going to read the poppy ball. And I know what a poppy is. And, well, it's a bowl, of course it's not a dish. It's like a super bowl, I guess. Number one, months before Poppy Bowl 9 was televised, the stars of the show arrive in New York City, where the big event is filmed. New York City, Poppy Bowl, is like the Super Bowl. There, in a film studio, 63 poppies, 21 kittens, 9, oh, so cute, hedgehogs, and 6 hamsters participated in the 2013 Poppy Bowl. With their big eyes and clumsy ways, puppies are very cute to watch on a football field. Mm -hmm. Audiences agree. The puppy ball has become an annual event, drawing as many as, wow, 12, mo 12 million viewers. Play by play. Subtitle. Play by play. What is play by play? Number two. The Poppy Bowl began in 2005 when the, cha when the cable channel Animal Planet had a problem. Each year, more than 100 million Americans stopped everything to watch the Super Bowl. There you go. The biggest football game in the year. These left few viewers to watch the shows on Animal Planet on the day of the Super Bowl. The cable channel decided to create a show that viewers will find interesting. Of course, and then they created the Super Bowl with pets. Oh, that's cute. Many people like the idea of a poppy ball and they're giving me this photo so I can see the, the poppies trying to score a point for the team. That is so cute. Many people like the idea of a poppy ball. It is like a real football game in many ways. The poppy ball is played in a stadium, okay, I'm going to underline that, with footballs. However, the stadium is much smaller than a regular football stadium. In fact, it is close to the size of a school classroom. And the football shears in the Poppy Bowl are real footballs. They are two toys of different shapes and sizes. Oh, that should be fun. Like a real football field, the Poppy Bowl Stadium has fields, goals in the end zones, a green field that is marked with lines and advertisements posted on the surrounding walls. Of course, there is a major difference between the Super Bowl and the Poppy Bowl. The Poppy Bowl is played by puppies. Puppies, not humans. <laughs> but that's not all. The Poppy Bowl has an entertaining halftime show performed by kittens. This is super cute, the halftime show. Uh, for the 2013 show, hamsters operated a blimp camera and hedgehogs were the cheerleaders. Oh. Okay, picking puppy players, question mark, and I'm going to write down how, how did they pick up the puppy players, okay? This is informational, I change subtitles to questions, and when I have an answer to the question, I have, I will be summarizing that section. Four, animal shelters throughout the country send in pictures of their puppies, hoping one will be chosen. Okay, animal shelters. Sending pictures. Each puppy is photographed next to a soda can so that the judges can see its size. That's smart. People's are, puppies are typically between 8 and 16 weeks old. And each puppy is available for adoption. Okay. Petfinder.com, an organization that helps people find pets, picks the players based on cuteness and their ability to play well with others. Oh, So cuteness, ability to play with others. Five. Once the puppies are chosen, they are flown to New York City and taken to a film studio. Many volunteers are waiting at the studio to welcome the puppies, kittens, and other animal participants in the puppy ball. So even though it is called a puppy ball, you have puppies, kittens, and you have other pets. That's important to know. Puppy protection. I'm going to change this into a question. How do they... Okay, puppy protection. How do they protect the puppies? I'm going to write down the question. How did they, did they okay, how did they, I cannot write the letter TH, oh, here we go. How did they protect the puppies? When I change that, the subtitle into a question, I will be able to Focus even better 
understand even more and I will be able to summarize the selection the section of the selection okay at the studio camera crews from film the puppies and other animals in action while the puppy ball is being recorded the puppies and other animals are well cared for by all volunteers and crew members okay volunteers and crew members in addition oh the vet there is a vet there a veterinarian examines each puppy before he goes on camera and gives medical care Oh, it gives medical care that might be needed during the game. A worker from the Humane Society supervises all play. And they're going to ask me for the word supervise. Um, and I can always use a dictionary, but I can also use inference. So I can replace the word supervises or supervise with a word that I already know, that it will fit the sentence and make sense. A worker from the Humane Society oversees all play. Uh, a, a worker from the Humane Society uh, takes care, so um, so overseas. Let me hear. Takes takes care. Uh, overseas. Mm, pays attention. Okay. The puppies are filmed for only 20 minutes at a time to make sure that they stay safe and they enjoy themselves. To make the game fair, the puppies are divided into groups so that they play with puppies their own size. This is important, that's how they take care of them. So with 20 minutes, having a vet, uh, checking that they don't play with bigger dogs. Even though puppies do not know how to play football, they seem to have fun on the field. There are Puppy tug of war contest, puppies training, tripping over their own feet, and puppies falling into the water bowl, as well as puppies that seem confused as, and simply sit on the field. Oh, that is so cute. So, how do they take care? Of, uh, how do they? How do they offer puppy protection? Uh, that's a question for the subtitle. So I can say because they have volunteers that take care of the puppies, and they have a vet. They give medical care. They let them play just in, in intervals of 20 minutes so they can rest. There is someone from the Humane Society overseeing it all. They make sure that the puppies play with other puppies their own size. And that's how they can protect the puppies. Number eight. Oh, look. Look at the photo. Which way do they go? Do we go? They're confused. They're having fun. <laughs> Why didn't you put the photo there so you can see how the actual game goes? Okay. A referee watches the puppy during the game and stops the game when necessary. There's a referee. If a puppy jars a toy to the end of the field, the referee announces a touchdown. Volunteers cheer when they hear the news. A puppy that gets too playful on the field may have to take a break. A puppy that falls asleep gets a timeout. And when there is a personal fall, a volunteer quickly grabs some paper towels to suck in the puddle. Ah, oh, they pee. <laughs> Sometimes they do. The staff members at Animal Planet enjoy the company of the puppies until the camera crews have collected many hours of film. Then they review the film and select the cutest moments to share with the viewers of the puppy ball. Everyone wins. How? How is it that everyone wins? In addition to the cuteness and fun, the puppy ball has a serious side. This is how. All the puppies, kittens, and other animals come from, from animal shelters. And by the end of the puppy ball each year, all of them are adopted. That's how. But that's not all. PetFinder.com reports that the puppy ball increases the overall number of adoptions nationwide. The puppy ball is always a fun day with a happy ending for both animals and humans. And we do have Fumble, the 2012 puppy ball's most valuable puppy, that's the name, with his new owner. He adopted the puppy. So I guess everyone wins because you are watching uh, TV, you're enjoying yourself watching the puppies playing football and then if um they're if you don't have already a pet you're gonna want to go out and adopt a, uh, a pet or if you already have a pet you're gonna be, you know, be careful with the pet that you have and 
being grateful, I guess. Those are my inferences, okay? Let's continue. Let's read. Okay, let's go, let's go to the questions. Which detail from the selection supports the idea that people enjoy watching the pop people? So, people enjoy. Which one of these four tells you that people enjoy? A. Okay, here we go. A. Animals are filmed months before the Super Bowl takes place. Does that tell you that people enjoy themselves watching the Super Bowl? Nope, it doesn't. Okay. The Poppy Bowl is seen by as many as lots of people are watching. Does that tell you that people enjoy watching it? Yes, watching, seeing. Yes. Animal shelters throughout the country send pictures. Does that tell you that they enjoy watching the Super Poppy Bowl? No. The Poppy Bowl can be seen on the same day as the Super Bowl. It can be seen. Does that mean that they watch it? No. Which one is the best choice? This one right here. The Poppy Bowl is seen as many as by as many as 12.4 million viewers every year. This means that lots of people watch it because they love it. All right. Next question. The main purpose of the selection is to purpose. Pie. You remember? Persuade. Inform. Entertain. Okay, it's informative, informational. Compare football players. Football players with puppies. Are they comparing? No. Describing how puppies learn to play. They don't, they don't learn to play, they just play. Sometimes they sit down, sometimes they fall asleep, sometimes, you know. Persuade the reader to adopt a pet. A pet. It, are they telling us about the advantages and disadvantages of adopting pets? Not at all. Provide facts about a popular animal show. Informational passages give us facts. So this is my correct answer. Provide facts about a popular animal show. Next question. Which sentence from the selection expresses the author's opinion? An opinion. I'm going to write it down. What's your opinion about hamburgers? What's your opinion about pizzas? Opinions are the things that you feel and the things that you think. Okay. I can say that pizza is better than hamburgers. Pizzas are better than hamburgers, but that's my opinion, is what I think. So now that I know or reminded myself about what an opinion is, I can read my choices and think. A, with their big eyes and clumsy ways. Puppies are very cute to watch on a football field. Oh, puppies are very cute. This is an opinion. The cable channel decided to create a show. This is a fact. They decided that. I, it, opinion will be, an opinion will be, they made the right decision. That's an opinion. Of course, there is a major difference between the Super Bowl and the Poppy Bowl. Okay, there is a major difference. I'm not saying if it's a good difference or a bad inference. I'm um, sorry, difference. It's a fact. Petfinder.com reports that the Poppy Bowl increases the overall number of adoptions. Okay, that is a fact. But puppies are very cute. That's my, or that is an opinion. Okay, next question we have. What do all the Poppy Bowl participants have in common? Oh, I remember. They are, they are good for adoption. They are all the same breed? No. They are all the same size? No. They are all used to playing games? No. They are all available for adoption? Yes. This is my right answer right there. Next question, number five. Read the following information about the origin of the word supervise from the Latin super 
Close vidre meaning to see, super, V to perceive. Oh, remember that I wrote down the word overseas? Oh, wow. And it, I bet that if you find the word supervise in the dictionary, it will come, you will see this one right here. So super, like Superman, over. And vidre, which means to see. So this information has to read or know that the word supervises in paragraph. Oh, I moved it. Let me move it. Paragraph six. There you go. Uh, means what? What does it mean? Encourages? No. Judges? No. Determines? No. Watches this. Okay. It doesn't encourage. It, it doesn't judge. It doesn't determine. It watches. Watch. See. Okay. Oh, that was easy. Next question. The author organizes information in paragraph three by, I have no idea. Paragraph three, and it's asking about organization. Text organization, so I need to go find my paragraph three. This is not it. Let me minimize this, and minimize this one, and minimize, uh oh, I don't know what I did. Minimize this one. And this one too. Here we go. This is my paragraph three. It's right here. All right. So let me move this. So it says, uh, many people like the idea of a poppy ball. It's like a real football game in many ways. I think it's compare and contrast. The poppy ball is played in a stadium with footballs however i think it's compare and contrast it's comparing and contrasting uh the real football with the poppy ball however the stadium is much smaller than a regular football stadium oh, it's comparing here in fact it is closer to the size of a school classroom all the football students in the poppy ball are real comparing the footballs comparing the stadium there are two toys, like a real football field. It has field goals, so it's uh, something they have in common. A green field, so it is compare and contrast. Advertisements, it has advertisements. There is a difference. Okay, these are my keywords. Like and difference. Okay. So, how is it organized? by compare and contrast. Explaining why a game played by puppies is better than the same game played by humans. Is it explaining how it is better? No. Listing the reasons a cable channel created the puppy ball. No. Comparing to the real one. Yes. Showing all the ways a puppy football is entertaining to watch. No. What is my correct answer? Is this one right here. Comparing the puppy football game to a real football. And the question that I know, they will always ask. The best summary, the best summary should have beginning, middle, end, which is an idea of all the sections and no details. Okay? Here we go. The puppy ball gathers animals from across the country hmm, and fills them for a show that airs on the cable channel Animal Planet. The 2013 show included puppies, kittens, hamsters, and hedgehogs playing a kind of football game. Okay, do you know what is missing? It's missing the point where they are ad ready to be adopted. The puppy ball, the puppy ball is meant to uh, help people or help, help the pets to find a home. So it's not talking about that, and that's an important part. B, the cable channel Animal Planet created the puppy ball to air on the day of the Super Bowl. The show brings together animals from shelters around the country, across the country so they can participate in a football game. Viewers are encouraged to adopt the show participants. Beautiful. It has beginning, it has middle, it has end, all the important things, no um, details. Let me read the other ones. When the cable channel Animal Planet realized that viewers were leaving the channel, this is all of these you can get rid of and it wouldn't matter. It's a detail. 
Okay, a show was created to bring viewers back. This show is called Above the Ball, features puppies and other animals, but it doesn't say who from where, so no. The puppy ball is found in a studio from the cable channel Animal Planet. Puppy, okay. Mm. Puppies are found playing a ver version of football. Kittens have certain hedgehogs have also been featured from the show, and these are details. So this one has details, it cannot be, this one has details, it cannot be, this one doesn't have the most important part about the adoption, let me make a correct answer. Sorry, let me go back to the other.